Hello Foodtubers, I am back and I'm gonna be making lamb kofta wraps today. Quick, tasty, stick with me and we'll knock up something nice. Let's get involved. Main ingredients for the wrap obviously is the lamb. We've got a nice bit of minced lamb here. It's important that you've got a good bit of fat in there, okay, to create more flavour obviously and you have to put less oil in a pan, very important. So let's spice it up a bit, let's give it a bit of character. Look, a little bit of dried chilli. We've got some ground coriander there. Let's have a look, we've got a nice little bit of cumin. Lamb, they love these sort of flavours, you know, cumin, coriander, paprika. That'll be a beautiful one. Again, cayenne pepper, be careful because it is quite spicy. I've put some dry chilies in and I want to put some fresh chilies in as well. You know, know what you're doing when it comes to balance of flavours. Okay, you can add, but you can't take away. So let's get a bit of pepper. Again, pepper's quite spicy, so not too much, okay? A nice bit of salt, okay? Now it's getting exciting. Let's mince some garlic up. If you're confident, you can sort of start mincing it. There's the technique to mince it, okay? So pretty much you just take off the skin like that, get a nice firm grip here, and then you just literally, you're mincing it like that, all right? Scrape that up, and then you just pop that in. Now, dried apricots, I love these. You want them quite fine. In we go with the apricots. Okay, it's got a few there. It's really all about just sort of getting everything everywhere. Do you know what I mean? You want to be quite consistent. So just really mix it up. I need some herbs now. Nice bit of time. Don't get the stalks in there because it will be woody and it won't be nice to eat. Chop it up quite fine. All right, so in we go with some thyme. Now we need a little bit of acidity, a little bit of citrus. Let's go with a little bit of lemon, watch this. Hey. Oh yes. Just take a little bit of it off, it's not too much. Oh my goodness, it comes out, it's really nice and fragrant. So that goes in there, just sort of rain it over. So there we go, that's our meat. So again, just give it another little massage. The lamb's done, I'll bring the skewers over. I've put them in some water. Obviously that will stop them from burning or going all charcoal-y. Uh, you want them to look good. Get your, your lamb off. I mean, it depends. If you want to get four out of this, right? You can either put a little bit of water on your hands or a little bit of oil on it and it will stop it sticking. There's a little touch on there like that. All right, and it's a bit easier then because look, it just comes off. That's pretty much the kofta there, okay? And let's just put a little bit of cumin on there and a bit of cayenne, all right? That's it. I reckon I can get four out of that, okay? Fantastic, that's it. Let's knock up the rest. Basically, I've got the, uh, the old tortilla wrap there, and it's dry at the moment. There's no oil or meat on it. Now, it's gonna take literally six seconds. Yeah? That's it, pop the old bad boys on. I will advise you to use some tongs. Uh, it's gonna be probably um, eight to 10 minutes in total if you wanna keep turning them. As soon as they come away uh, without really any force, you can turn them over. Now, look at that, beautiful. Can you see that caramelization there? It's not taking long at all. I'm being very careful. You do have to sort of coach it off, so be careful. All right, it's very, very hot. But I can see in there and it's literally starting to go like a light brown now, the pink's disappearing. So I know that there is about, I don't know, a minute left on that, all right? This is the point where you want to get the honey on, right? Just before you take them off to rest, wallop like that, all over the top, all right? That's literally it, okay? And then you just turn them quickly so it's, you've got them on that side as well, all right? That's it. Just like that, oh, it's lovely. Let's get them over here, get them off, be very gentle. Some of them will stay together, some might be a bit difficult. While they're resting, I'll get on with the dressing. All right, the old iceberg. Get your salad in. Here we go, we've got a chilli here. Little matchsticks. There we go, a little bit of chilli. Just get a bit of onion, a bit of red onion. All right, you're nice and thin. I'm gonna put in some pistachios into this one, all right? I like them. So I'm just gonna toast them. They always taste a little bit better. A little bit of lemon juice. A big old pomegranate sitting there, wanting to get involved. It's quite a big one, that. Again, these are giving a nice fruity sort of, and then a surprise, like a little crunchy surprise, okay? Two of those. You're just smashing them a bit. Oh, yeah. There you go. It's time. 
it's time for you to go to bed in the duvet of love, right there, all right? Uh, let's go in a bit of salad first. Not too much, remember, you've got to roll this up. In with the kofta, take out your skewer. You don't want to choke on that. Let's get a little bit of yogurt, all right? Nuts, let's get those lovely roasted nuts in there. Fresh coriander. Right, here we go. Let's tuck it all in. You roll it over and then sort of give it a little squeeze, like that. And then you fold that end in, and then you just give it a little rip, a little rip. Voila, look at that, lovely. Mm. There's so much happening in there. I can taste every ingredient. I wouldn't change a thing, that's perfect. Please try it. If you want to try it, you know what to do. Click on the link, subscribe, absolutely free. Anything else you want me to do, leave a comment. Easy. Mm.